Hello, I welcome you all. The problem reads I determine the moment of uh, the force about point O. So, in this particular problem, we need to resolve uh, the force into two components. So, we'll have one in this direction. So, this is going to be our x and this is going to be our y. Okay. So, let's do so. Let's check the angles that we have. So this one here, we know that this angle here is 30, right? It is 30. It is similar to this one here. Therefore, if you are to write down components, we'll have one component in this direction like so, the vertical. And then we'll have another component in this direction. In fact, we'll choose this to be our um, x and then we we'll choose this to be our y okay so this is our coordinate system let me write it down here so we have this one like so this is our coordinate system that we've chosen so this is our y and this is our x okay so we're saying this one here is our x so let me just uh, write this. Uh, I write this once more again. Uh, right. So to do this, like so. Okay. So then we know that this one here is thirty degrees. So this is six hundred. Uh, this is 600 sine 50, 20 plus um, 30, then this one is 600 cos 50. Okay, then uh, our moment, we are saying the resultant moment about point O and clockwise being our reference is just going to be equal to the summation of FD. And this is equal to, so let's start with uh, the horizontal arc component about point O. So this one is in this direction like so, which is anti-clockwise. So it gives us a 600 uh, cos 50 times the lever arm, which is 0.5. Okay. And then the other one there, which is also anti-clockwise, which is positive, so we just say plus 600 sine 15 um, plus um, uh, I mean times 5, okay, times 5. Therefore, the resultant moment about point O is just equal to, uh, let's calculate, so we'll have 600 cos 15, uh, 600 cos 15 times 0.5 plus 600 sine 15, 600 sine 15 okay times 5 so this gives us a 2490.97 uh, this is 97 um, pounds feet okay you can convert it to kips if you want to I'll leave it like this, so 600 cos 15 by 0.5 plus 600 sine 15 um, by 5, 2490.97. So this also we can write it as 2490.97. Pounds, feet, 
and then this one is anti-clockwise okay like that so we can show it also here so we do have the moment in this direction we are having the moment in this direction like this and this one is 2490.97 pounds feet okay all right so let's outline this one like so let's outline it all right so i think this is about it and i hope this particular video is helpful and if it was give me a thumbs up like my video continue subscribing and sharing my channel bye bye and i'll see you in my next uh, screencast